To watch the latest from India Science, don't forget to subscribe to the channel and press on the bell icon to get notifications on all the science related videos. Electricity from renewable energy sources like solar or wind could help build a low carbon world. Electric vehicles rely on either batteries or hydrogen fuel cells to function. Today we'll compare battery electric vehicles or BEV and hydrogen fuel cell electric vehicles or FCEVs in terms of efficiency and their impact on the environment. The most common batteries used in electric cars are lithium ion batteries which also power our laptops and mobile phones. Hydrogen fuel cells on the other hand use hydrogen to generate electricity. Last week we told you that hydrogen does not occur freely in nature and that it needs to be produced. Grey hydrogen is made using fossil fuels and green hydrogen from renewable sources of electricity. We also told you that India is trying to establish itself in the green hydrogen sector. So how can we use green hydrogen in vehicles fitted with hydrogen fuel cells? Hydrogen fuel cells contain a positive electrode or anode and a negative electrode or cathode. Hydrogen is fed to the anode and oxygen to the cathode. A catalyst present in the cathode separates hydrogen's negatively charged electrons from the positively charged protons. The electrons move to the cathode through an external circuit generating electricity. The protons pass through a membrane before reaching the cathode. Once the electrons and protons reach the cathode, they combine with oxygen to form water and heat. According to the Canadian Hydrogen and Fuel Cell Association, hydrogen fuel cell electric cars have a carbon footprint of 2.7 grams of carbon dioxide per kilometer compared to batteries 20.9 grams. Hydrogen cars from Toyota, Honda and Hyundai are already on the market. However, BEVs have the upper hand in terms of popularity. Tesla, Tata, Nexon, Hyundai are some of the famous players in the market. Over 8,500 hydrogen fuel cell vehicles were sold in 2020. As for BEVs, the figure was 3.1 million. Hydrogen fuel cells electric vehicles have an inefficiency problem, which means a lot of energy is lost at different stages. First, when hydrogen is produced, then its transportation and storage, and finally when the stored hydrogen is converted into electricity inside the fuel cells. The overall efficiency for batteries is 76% compared to 23% of hydrogen fuel cells. Some of the other limitations of FCEVs are that hydrogen is flammable and expensive to produce. But hydrogen cars do not need recharging unlike their BEV counterparts. And BEVs are not without their shortcomings. The batteries contain lithium, cobalt and other metals which need to be mined. Mining of lithium has shot up by over 58% in the last decade. Extracting metals could deplete water reserves and impact sensitive ecosystems. Perhaps we should stop pitting batteries against hydrogen fuel cells. Both seem to have some role to play. While batteries could power small vehicles, Hydrogen seems better equipped to support trucks and airplanes that undertake long-distance travel. 